This is a series of videos featuring the hotels that we stay in when we're traveling. Now our budget is $15 each per day, and that's for absolutely everything, not just for accommodation. And we never book anything. Uh, a lot of the hotels that we stay at aren't on booking sites. They don't take credit cards, they don't take debit cards, cash only. Now these videos are in no particular order of our travels. So we're gonna show you what the room is like, and after a few days of staying there, we're gonna tell you at the end of the video what the stay was like. Another edition of where we stay and what we pay. We are at Hotel Via Del Mar, and where are we? We're in Livingston, Guatemala. Um, so we came here from Puerto Barrios. And this was our third stay here, believe it or not. We were here in 2013 and 2014. And uh, I gotta say that I was a little concerned that this place didn't exist anymore. Just uh, recently going onto Google Maps and looking at the lay of the land around here in Livingston, I got the distinct impression this place wasn't here. Um, uh, the last review was from four years ago. Uh, there was no icon on the map to indicate that there was a hotel right here. So when we got off the boat today from Puerto Barrios, we made a beeline here. And lo and behold, it was open. But there's no sign outside. So you still would never guess that this was a functioning hotel. Right. Or even was a hotel at any point in its life. Um, so we kind of tentatively pushed the gate open and popped in. And it even took a while, like, you know, for, for the lady to, to show up. We, we took a little nosy around and we came to the conclusion it probably still was a hotel and it was only when she confirmed it we were like, good, it does still operate. Yeah, so we're very happy uh, yeah. that our first place worked out for us because this would have been our first choice even I... if we knew it was open, we would have come here. So, yep. it was open. All right, so this is the first room she showed us and we took this because of the balcony out here, the kind of communal balcony. Unfortunately, somebody's out of here painting, so we're not going to spend too much time out here, but you do have a nice little view out over the street. Town is that way. And you actually have a sea view right down there, probably about, uh, I don't know, 300 yards down the road, so not bad. Nice little spot to hang out in the evening, watch the sunset. And you're actually, you're only sharing this balcony with two other rooms, so it's not like some big massive balcony. And I think we're the only guests here in the boat. Yeah, because there's no sign up saying it's a hotel. Who knows? <laughs> you have to be in the know. This is like a top secret place. And there's this bit of artwork on the wall. No, that isn't a window looking out to the sea. You've already seen the sea view, but uh, it's a nice little touch. And. You spotted this, Fiona, I didn't even see that. Yeah, it's like another little local landscape up on the, uh, the pelvis there. All right. And we have screens in the windows. Both of these windows have screens. Uh, nice little sea breeze coming in. And well, an ocean view. Yeah, you could... That one's got the ocean view there. Yeah, that's right. We actually have two ocean views, one from the balcony, one from this window. We do. Sockets. Sockets. Does that work? Yeah. This one's dodgy looking, but it works. You have to take my word for it. Um, let's see. Fan. Oscillating fan. It works. Wonderful. Another window with screen in it. A little cross draft going in the evening. Two towels. That's still a bonus to this very day. Look at these individual unique tiles here. Each one of these is unique. Like yeah, these tiles are absolutely gorgeous. Lovely. All right. Uh, we have a nice sturdy piece of furniture here. The TV, a flat screen TV on top of that. Um, there's a couple shelves in there for storage. Not bad. Not bad at all. All right. Chair, which is nice. Little bookshelf. That's going to be handy like for charging stuff. Yeah, there you Just go. Sit it up there. All right. Go rack. Nice touch there. I like that. Yeah. See how easily placed we are? Oh my gosh. Man. Bright bathroom. Yeah. So. Toilet seat, Fiona, can you believe that? Yeah, and still, my God, little, spoiled. My little tiles in here as well. Alright. I'm gonna guess 
This is a cold water shower only. And there's only one tap. There's a shower curtain, which makes sense. Believe it or not, you don't always get, we don't always get that. And, and a lip. And a lip to contain the water. We don't always get that either. So that's gonna spare making a mess all over the floor if we shower. I'm gonna gingerly just put one toe in at a time. That's cold water, because it is winter here right now, and it's not as hot, hot and humid no. as it can get. Here. It's really pleasant at the moment. Like the, the temperature is lovely. Yes. It's just not boiling and sticky and muggy the way it normally would be. So I don't know, cold water shower, um, I might skip a shower for a few days. Yeah, it is noon, you're right. It is, it's, it's quite pleasant here right now. It's you very know, pleasant, yeah. Compared to uh, what we've experienced here in the past, so. Uh, all right, Hotel Via Del Mar. Um, internet. Ah, yeah. Yeah, there is internet here, and uh, the router is down in the lobby, and there's like one single router. But uh, believe it or not, <laughs> if we open this door, uh, there's a very good chance that the internet is going to work. Uh, um, <laughs> I think if the breeze came along, it might shift the signal a little bit. But uh, with the door open, uh, I've got the internet to work in this room, and it definitely works out on the balcony. So, uh, um, it's not the strongest signal. Uh, it's reliable enough so far for surfing the web, not for downloading, but, uh, or for uploading, excuse me. So, not bad. And 150 quetzales, that's $19.35 US. Yep, and that's split between two of us. Yeah, that's right. It's 150 quetzales total for the room. So, let's see, anything else? Um, we are on the main street of town, we're just kind of further down towards the sea. Um, no parking, but again, there aren't that many cars around here. Most people get around by tuk-tuk or motorbike. So you won't see too, too many cars around Livingston. Um, I reckon that's it. I think that's it, yeah. It's really just, uh, I so the only thing that's a bit of a downside for me is the, the cold water. Cold water shower now, that's going to be a bit tough, which is why I'll probably skip it. <laughs> it's I'll be just a few days. I'll be the guinea pig, I'll let you know. Like I said, just sticking one one toe in at a time, I'll let you know how bad it is. Uh, it might be exhilarating, I don't know. Probably will be. But, <laughs> but I think the main thing is, I mean, we're both just absolutely thrilled that this place is still up and running. Yeah. Um, because even before coming here, like you said, you did research, it wasn't shown on Google Maps. It just wasn't looking too good. Um, we thought we were going to be wasting time having to walk around town and look for somewhere else. Um, so we are absolutely thrilled that Via Del Mar is still, still operating. Yeah, yeah we'll, we'll pass our first night here and um, tell you more about that later. Right, so our, our wrap up of Via Del Mar, Hotel Via Del Mar in Livingston, Guatemala. Right, it was our third time staying there and it was just as brilliant as the last two times. Um, I absolutely love it there. You? I do too. Uh, I was very happy to find out that the place is still functioning, um, like I said in the beginning of the video, so uh, that was good to see and a uh, nice friendly service there. Um, I think the only thing is the shower um yeah. again you know it is it's a really hot tropical climate it wasn't that boiling this time um but it is just cold water that you're getting so you kind of incrementally introduce your body <laughs> to the shower you know you start with the toe you kind of work your way up to the foot the ankle so on and so forth um so yeah it's, it's a very incremental shower that you take um and it's 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 definitely body temperature as in dead body temperature um it's not even really tepid it's, yeah it's just cold yeah yeah that's right um but we got it done so uh let's see the wi-fi didn't quite work in the room we had to open the door and uh take the little chair and sit out there um kind of in the on the balcony uh to get any wi-fi the the common balcony and that's pretty much where we spent most of our time anyway just kind of mm -hmm. hanging over the edge just watching Livingston pass by so uh, Livingston life <laughs> yeah 
Yeah, uh, the TV, I uh, never put it on. I never watched it, I should say, but there was like a really decent cable package there. Like, um, uh, I think if you, uh, we've never had cable, but I know from, from being at my mom and dad's house and being anywhere that has a good cable uh, package, there's always like a, like a little guide, you know? The, you know, it was one of those kinds of premium cable packages, loads of channels. Um, so you can kind of scoot through the guide and see what was coming on like in two hours or three hours or whatever. So uh, that was really good to see that anyway. I mean, considering how basic that hotel really was. So, uh, and it was comfortable there at night. It was quiet. Um, it's very, very quiet there. The whole town of Livingston is very quiet. Um, everything just seems to wind down at about seven o'clock in the evening. Um, we came up with a really good use for the metal door. Um, it attracts and it traps heat throughout the entire day. So when you've had your cold shower, you go out to the door and it works like a radiator. So you can get dressed by the door because it's emanating a little bit of heat from right. throughout the day. Yeah, back in 2013, uh, 2014, those doors were actually painted black. Mm. And when the sun would hit it, um, they I were mean, a heat trap. Oh my lord. Fantastic heat trap. So they're kind of like a gray color now and they're still mm, radiating a lot of heat, like you say. So, <laughs> you, gotta, you know, you, you got to use a door as double duty in this case. You know, this is, uh, um, this is your heater when you're stepping out of a cold shower, like you say. So, hey, all right. Anything else? Um, <laughs> bed was comfortable enough. Uh, the location is great. You're, you're just right there on the edge of town, little sea view. Um, again, there's no parking. Uh, there really aren't any vehicles in Livingston, per se. You really feel like you're on an island. You're not, you're on the mainland. But the main way to get to Livingston is by boat. So most people get around on mopeds, motorbikes, or tuk-tuks. Yeah. It's, it's very rare that you'll see any kind yeah. of car, vehicle, truck, anything at all there. It's pretty uh, isolated from the rest of the country. It there really are a is. few vehicles going around, uh, not many, so. Um, no need for parking there. Uh, let's see, what else? Um, it's perfect. Yeah. I think it's perfect. Via Del Mar. Um, really happy that it's still functioning. And can't wait to get back. Yeah. They're very kind. Extremely yeah. kind. So. Great place.